uh, 50 years of hip hop cam. Man. That W, man. Yeah, that dub. When you came with that dub, what was it that made you twist those fingers up <laughs> and yell it out, man? Man, that's a that's a Watts thing. So yeah. that was before me. It used to just be the three fingers, you okay. know what I'm saying? But, you know, that was a, a Watts. That's the City of Watts yeah. logo, you know what I'm saying? So that been around for, before I got on the mic. Okay. So Pac but, didn't come up with oh the no, West Coast. Oh, no. <laughs> No, no. That's who I that's that's who I thought. Oh, you no. in the room with the man right yeah. now. No, no, no. So so you say you were throwing home. that West Coast up before Pop. Oh yeah, before all of them. That's where they got it from. And okay. you know, that's all. Well love. you got West Coast cam on. Yeah, so yeah. Well, I had to actually do that because um uh Jim Jones uh and, and game along you know, a while back when they did certified gangster video. I was in the video, but then Cam Ryan from from East was in there, and they had to, they put that subtitle West Coast Cam, like, yeah. <laughs> like oh, I guess I'm West Coast Cam, and people start calling me that. I was yeah. like, all right, so they didn't get oh, so, it. so 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 West Coast Cam came by mistake. Yeah, I'm Cam. I'm Cam. So how you felt about that? I felt a little way about it because you know I was I've been you know I'm a I'm a vet you know from where I'm from yeah. and, and in the rap game and all of that. So once you know. Cam Ryan came out, you know what I'm saying? And people was like, Cam, Cam, Killer Cam, yeah, Cam, the original Cam. I'm like, no, nah, that's, that's not the original Cam. So, you know, yeah. instead of me feeding into the Willie Lynch thing, I, you know, I got supreme wisdom as a, as a FOI. Like, I just had to let it let it do what it do. And, you know, I seen him bubble, you know. Yeah. Salute but you felt salute. some type of way oh, about yeah. it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I mean, but that's the same way with all that's that. That's crazy. That's a crazy story. In, in the rap game, it's so many. Like, if you're original, you, you see the whole world using your slang or using exactly. something that you did or yeah. you know some and, and you know you was yeah. and nobody giving you your credit exactly. you're like whoa exactly. that's a hella I, trial that's I, a hella I, test don't yeah. pay me high yeah. just pay me money Man. yeah yeah yeah, yeah. So now, I, I feel it I yeah feel i'm it. one of those dudes yeah, yeah. me too yeah. <laughs> I'm saying. what was it like when you got into it with cube about it though man um well that was about something else you know cube is my brother you yeah. know what i'm saying i always love q we we don't agree or we might not agree on certain things but you know he put me on in the yeah. music I, I i put him on on the brotherhood mm. you know and in, in the army business you know what i'm saying That's so all right. so it was a it was a mutual respect and yeah. no no fair exchange no robbery whatever so that didn't have nothing to do with that that was some personal internal stuff yeah you know what i'm saying and that been squashed you know yeah. what i'm saying but of course i'm still me and i you know i'm headstrong and i'm Accountability, man. Yeah, accountability. Yeah, going on. Because that has something to do with, like, with Special Ed. Shout out Special Ed. That made a comment on Drink Champs a while back talking yeah. about uh, NWA, NWA yeah. and brought in the destruction of hip hop. Like, yeah. you know what I'm saying? So, you know, I didn't agree with that part, but I, agree, I agreed with what he was trying to say, which yeah. is, like, Turk is saying, we, we, you know, somebody else didn't write our raps. Yeah. We wrote our raps. Come on now. We, we know what. Was going on? We know that you know this is my little sister, or that's my mama, and you call them bitch or strawberry or whatever. I'm serving, you know what yeah. I'm saying? You know you're doing that to your community. You know you you know what it is. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Not saying that you know you, you worse than the, the one that's providing the dope and all yeah. of that, but you you still got to take your accountability. Don't mm -hmm. don't run from it or push the blame. Well, crack was always here and get, get violence was always here. Nah, nigga, it wasn't no commercials like this. That's mm -hmm. why they use niggas right now, rap right now to. To sell their products, yeah. you know what I'm saying. Don't act like you don't know you ain't a main instrument in the destruction or the detriment of, of our people. So, you know that's my problem. So when I see that, I yeah. got to speak on it. Just like if they act like they got to speak the way they speak, yeah. and then you know, and that's where the, the whoop whoop came from. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. <laughs> I'm with you. Yeah. Can you speak to you getting into the game early on, working with Cube, and then also introducing him to the FOI? Yeah. And um, that's that came by way of uh, uh, may a lot be pleased uh, Joshua Farrakhan, Minister Farrakhan's son, that just recently transitioned. Mm. So um, him, you know, well, Compton FOI, you know, I, I, I was uh, well, a member of Compton FOI in 1991. I got registered in Nation Islam. So 1991. Um, I hooked up with a couple of my homies from school, Solo, that's Franklin on uh, Grand Theft Auto, the main character. He's on me yeah. and Solo, you know what I'm saying? And my, my cousin, uh, rest in peace, laid back uh, from Watts. So we was, you know, we, we was doing our little street thing and had street money. And um, Solo knew somebody that knew Cube or whatever, you know, and 
he he had just left from NWA, so he started working on I think the Kill It Kill It Wheel EP or something like that. So we just happened to be at the studio, same studio at the same time, and Solo kind of had been dropping bugs in Cube ear or whatever that I got. I, you know, my homeboy get down, whatever. So, long story short, we was at the same studio at the same time. Uh, Echo Echo Sound, and um, we was working on our stuff, and he was over there working on uh on his stuff, and he came over there and listened to some some of the stuff we had and like what he heard. Man, I'm I'm doing this 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 label, man, called Street Knowledge, man. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? I want y'all to get out, you know. So long story short. You know that's where that's where that happened. My first uh, project with Cube was um, every single weekend off the Boys in the Hood movie soundtrack. Yeah, yeah, and then Colorblind off his album, mm-hmm. the song Colorblind. So, but you know, I was in his wedding. I cut his Jerry curl off, like you know, what I'm all that. So I was beefing with with Ren. Shout out to Ren, and you know, that's my brother, brother yeah. man. And, uh, you know, I was beefing with with him against N.W.A. at that yeah. time, but yeah. you know, we all. Brought it back together and all that. So, what was it like cutting Cube's Jerry curl yeah, off? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> all about the accent, man. That's crazy. And that's funny. It's Salute funny. to Cube. I'll yeah. probably give it, get a million dollars yeah. if I'd kept yeah. that little Jerry curl yeah. here. Yeah. <laughs> hey, cut the curl off. Yeah. yeah. Right. So, and it was at the same Put time. Put it on eBay. Right. Yeah. It was at the same time. Ren and then was saying like, "Yeah, we catch you. You know, we gonna we gonna cut your hair off and such and such." And you yeah. know. So, you know, he was kind of, we were laughing about it. He's like, but yeah, can I, you know, I, w- I want you to whack this off for me. I was like, yeah. real? Like, yeah, yeah, man, just, just cut it off. So he asked me to cut it off. You yeah. know what I'm saying? But, you know, that's when he was, you know, moving with the FOI. Yeah. And, you know, so everybody in the lynch mob had to study, you know what I'm saying? Uh, they had to clean our diets up and clean our language up and all yeah. of that. Not, you know, by, by you know, voluntarily, not of by, course. you know. So that was the strongest time in hip hop, you know what I'm saying? And that was the strongest movement, strongest brotherhood, and you know, 